Hey, Vinyl Community. It's Glenn, your low-end music for you. On a Saturday afternoon, just listen to Neil Young's great Tonight's the Night, Live at the Roxy. Love this album. I love listening to music with the lava lamps on and uh, just a bit of light, but unfortunately I had to turn all the lights on to do this uh, video. I thought I would just do a little bit of a tour of my uh, music room and uh, show a few box sets to, as a preview of my uh, fourth video, which is going to be on my favorite box sets. So, just going to kind of wander around a little bit. There's my stereo system. I have a few uh, of my box sets underneath the system. Under here is also, I've kept my stash of uh, Bob Dylan uh, bootleg series CDs and then two boxes of my Van Morrison collection, a lot of Van. My turntable, my George Harrison turntable. It's a project turntable. I won this in a raffle from uh, Zap Records in Coburg, Ontario, the greatest independent record store in Canada. And my nephew Jack gave me the platter cover there, the Beatles platter cover. Over to the Grateful Dead Pacific Northwest. Uh, my vinyl collection, all 42 records. And of course, Great Rhino Box set, Love Is All, the song we sing, uh, San Francisco based uh, music. Frank Zappa, the Hot Rat Session, what an amazing box set this was. My Beatles vinyl box set, Mono, my Holy Grail, the 50th anniversary of Abbey Road. The 6 CD White Album 50th Anniversary. The Sgt. Pepper Anniversary Box. More box set, Almond Brothers. Yes, King Crimson, Motown. Springsteen, Los Lobos. Michael Bloomfield. The Nugget San Francisco Box Set. The Woodstock box from last year. Now this is only the 10 or 12 CD set, not the massive uh, $800 box that sold out very quickly, surprisingly. But this set is, if for those of you who couldn't get the massive set, this set is fantastic. It's uh, It gives you at least three songs from every performer. And um, really, really love this set, well done. Okay, over to the CD collection here. There are about 2,100 titles in my collection. This is the wall of uh, CDs that you've seen behind me when I've done my first two videos. Up top, I keep uh, a bunch of box sets. There's the Animals, Beatles, number one, Beatles mono and stereo CD box sets. I love these Jethro Tull book style box sets. Moody Blues, In Search of the Lost Chord, my favorite Moody Blues album. And one of the greatest albums of all time, In the Court of the Crimson King. This is the 50th anniversary box. It's fantastic. It's, the outtakes are amazing. Bob Dylan. I love Bob. Rolling Thunder Review. I was fortunate enough to go to both uh, shows at Maple Leaf Gardens in 1975. The 1966 uh, live recording box, the original mono recordings, and some deluxe bootleg series sets. Frank Zappa, Halloween 73 in New York. Yes, there's a box set of uh, all their studio albums. Plus um, the live tour from 72, which includes a show from Maple Leaf Gardens in Toronto. There are my uh, MoFi SACDs. Uh, more Zappa. Zappa in New York. 
And my favorite Zappa box, the Roxy box, this set is amazing and it's actually, I think there's six or seven CDs and it sells only for about 60 bucks. It's well worth it, a fantastic set. Now we're gonna tour into uh, my music, other music room where the actual live music happens. Just excuse me while I get a light on here. My Ernie Ball Stingray bass guitar. I started playing bass guitar about three years ago and just uh, fell in love with it. It's kind of become my main instrument. Um, I did play five string banjo and, and still do, but uh, for about 45 years I've been playing, uh, picking a banjo. Just a beautiful instrument, I love it. This was a custom made banjo. Uh, Rob Bishline out of Oklahoma made it and it's a, just a gorgeous instrument. My Takamine acoustic guitar. I've learned three chords on the guitar and I've stuck with them ever since. Uh, I just bought this bookcase today and set it up. So some Beatles stuff, Janice poster, Grateful Dead tapestry. And that's pretty much the whole tour I'm gonna to give you today. Um, stay tuned for my fourth video which is uh, should have up in a couple of days just discussing my favorite box sets I hope you guys have a great weekend and thanks so much for watching